Jackson, touchdown! Rolling right on the boot. Martin throwing long for Woods. He has a chance to get this. He's got it. He's in the end zone. Pitch back. Tyler Student body left behind him. Block with Khalil. He's in the end zone for his 12th career touchdown. Mark Tyler, welcome back to the lineup. Dejon Harris is all over him. Barkley throws back in the end zone. Touchdown! Xavier Grimble. Fires the seed. Caught! Denver! Touchdown, SC! Look at his fullback touchdown. What else? Drops the throw. Long. Marquise Lee is all alone. Pulls yeah. it for the second time. McDonald. Hit. Sacked by Nick Perry. Maynard fires, intercepted, Chris Gallipo. Fire into traffic and he's picked up in the end zone. Throws for the end zone, open wood, diving, catch, he's got it. Bubble on the play, the ball goes to the backfield, to one for Sterling, all the way in the end zone for a UFC touchdown. Throw, complete over the middle of Carlisle to the five, down to the goal line, he's in the end zone, and they'll make it. McGrady picks up the first. McGrady down the sideline. makes life so interesting. The theory of evolution claims only the strong shall survive. Maybe so. Maybe so. But the theory of competition says just because they're the strong doesn't mean they can't get their asses kicked. That's right. See, what every long shot come from behind underdog will tell you is this. The other guy may in fact be the favorite. The odds may be stacked against you, fair enough. But what the odds don't know is this isn't a math test. This is a completely different kind of test. One where passion has a funny way of trumping logic. So before you step up to the starting line, before the whistle blows and the clock starts ticking, just remember out here, the results don't always add up. No matter what the stats may say, and the experts may think, and the commentators may have predicted, when the race is on, all bets are off. Don't be surprised if somebody decides to flip the script and take a pass on yelling uncle. And then suddenly, as the old saying goes, we got ourselves a game.
huge mistake. A huge mistake for us to single out any people in this room. A gigantic mistake. We ain't singling out anybody. Because we talked about all week. We talked about last night, we talked about this morning, it would take everybody. No matter whether you are a true freshman or a fifth year senior, it was going to take every single person in this locker room to not only beat the number three team in the country, not only that, but to snap the longest home winning streak in the world. Yeah! I want you to channel back right now. Close your eyes and channel back to the last play of the Oregon game. Close your eyes, go. Channel yourself exactly where you were at, exactly what was on your mind, and what you would do anything, anything to win that last play and win that game. The strain to finish as we watched last night on that final clip was nothing like anything before. It was an unbelievable amount of Trojan willpower to win the game. We own LA and we show it tonight. Stay right where you're at, seniors get up, walk out. Barkley Chase steps up in the pocket, throws for the home run, touchdown! Getaway, X deep cross. So he's been coming over their motion and let him get squared up on the motion of four yards, coming in like the same thing we went through. Another deep ball, he's got bad coverage this time. Flag is down, and the ball is in the hands of Marquis Lee. What a play! Step drop up top and goes wide open. Goodbye, Robert Woods. Touchdown. USC only scored half a hundred fifty points today on UCLA, and UCLA happened to score nothing. For the first time in years around here, we now have a thousand yard rusher. But two sacks today. Two sacks. He counts. He counts. He counts. Had 111 catches. Oh. Walked his way into the Blitnikoff Award. Robert Woods. Thirteen catches for 224 yards. Oh. Oh. Always recruiting. All he did today was go 36 of 43 for 433 yards, six touchdowns. Oh. Oh.